we're gonna be unboxing the glorious fire let me kind of it's it's huge and it's uh uh there we go okay that's kind of showing it right Th there we go okay we're gonna be unboxing it um i'm gonna get a real knife a real knife Let's hope uh, this does not get me in trouble with YouTube. Like, I'm not doing anything bad with it. I'm just unboxing a, a mouse pad. I, I'm... Ugh, how do I cut that? How do I cut that properly? I don't want to cut the mouse pad. This is also my first mouse pad that's come flat like this before. So I'm intrigued for that reason as well. Like, I know, I know why it comes flat, obviously, but... Gotta be, gotta be careful here. Gotta be careful. Always cut away from yourself, chat. Don't cut towards yourself. Here we go. Nice. And I wonder if I can just kind of... Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. All right. Cool. Brings out the knife so people don't make fun of his baby scissors. Dude, they're not baby scissors, okay? All right, let's read a little bit on the back of this mouse pad. All right, so it's a hybrid cloth service with uniform X and Y tracking, which is a big deal for a lot of people. A lot of people don't like to have ununiform X and Y tracking. Um, it's a competitive esports gaming mouse pad. We'll see about that. Um, let's see. So medium to fast glide with excellent stopping power, which kind of reminds me of like the Equate, the Equate Plus. Let's see. Read before use. Do not roll or reverse roll the mouse pad. Okay. Do not bend, fold, or roll the mouse pad inside out. Roll or fold the mouse pad can develop creases and become damaged. Store in dry conditions away from high temperatures. Okay. It's kind of bougie. All right. I, I need to take this off the desk so I can actually, like, open it. Sorry. All right. And there's a piece of cardboard in there. All right. We have some other stuff in the box. We got... That looks like a little little pamphlet with other stuff. That's a sticker. And wow, that mouse pad smell. Ooh, that is strong. That is a strong odor. Oh man. Wow. That is a very, very strong mouse pad odor, dude. The moment we were waiting for. Dude, it, this packaging is impossible to open on my desk with my mic on here. I'm sorry. Okay. Throw that down there. All right, let's see. Let's see. So, um, well, it's a black mouse pad. So, I, I, this is not really the most exciting unboxing uh, I've ever done. I mean... It's a solid black mouse pad, chat. Let's let's see the, let's see this glide. Oh, okay. Yeah, this reminds me a lot of the Equate Plus. This reminds me a lot of the Equate Plus, dude. Um, yeah, that's that's a fast glide. I It's decent stopping power. It's not Yeah, that's that's decent. That's decent. I, I think this will work nice. What company is it from? It's from Glorious. It is the Glorious Fire. They came up with three mouse pads. I think it's the fire, the ice, the wind. This is the fire. It's the uh, the hybrid speed and control pad. Uh, it's fast. It's fast, dude. It's fast. Fast glide. We'll see how much I like it. This might be a, this might honestly be a little bit too fast for me. We'll just kind of have to see. We'll just kind of have to see what happens. All right. Hey everybody, I just wrapped up my first stream with the Glorious Fire mouse pad here just a moment ago, and I just wanted to record a few of my quick first impressions 
on this mouse pad. So first off, as far as build quality goes, the stitched edges here are very, very good. They're hardly noticeable at all. And even where the stitches kind of overlap, honestly, you can hardly tell where it is with the naked eye. You really have to kind of inspect it to find it. Uh, so that's very promising there with the build quality. Uh, the branding is also very clean and minimal. If you, I don't know if you can see that very well right here by my thumb, but that's all there is to it. It's just a solid black surface other than that. Uh, and then speaking of the surface itself, I do already have one blemish here. You can kind of see that on the camera. I apologize that it's not slightly better but you see that little blemish right there a little disappointing it it's not a huge deal but um a, a, a little bit of a bummer i kind of feel like it shouldn't have one yet because i've used the pad for three hours that's it um then the glide itself i would say that it's just a little bit faster than the equate plus with slightly better stopping power than the equate plus um that's probably the closest pad that i could really compare it to but the surface feels really nice it's like this hybrid cloth hard surface material well not not a hard surface but you know it's a hybrid material pad um and it feels really good i used it mostly with the model o wireless today and it was excellent um, and then as far as actual gameplay goes on the pad, tracking is a dream. Like using the R99 and Apex, R301 was awesome for real. Like the glide and the stopping power when paired together just make for some very, very good tracking. Like you're not going to overshoot a ton, but you're also going to stay right on that target. It's a great combination. And then flick shots as well, I actually noticed were also really, really good. Um, yeah, I mean, the glide is just really, really good. Even with Teflon feet, I tried it briefly with my G305, which still has the out of the box Teflon feet on it. And it's still a superb glide. It is a little bit better with the PTFE feet, but, um, I mean, even without it, it's still a very nice glide. And for the price of $35 plus shipping, I don't really know if you can go too wrong with this pad. There will, of course, be a full review for it in a couple of weeks. Just give me some time to have a little more time with it, and I will get that review out for you. But yeah, all right, well, if you have not hit the like button and the subscribe button, I would really appreciate it if you could do that. And tune into my streams. I'm now streaming Tuesday and Thursday at noon West Coast time, as well as the occasional weekend stream as well. So make sure you're there. Feel free to turn notifications on as well. You know the drill. And uh, yeah, I'll see you all in the next one. Peace!